everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Camden and I'm so happy to have you here with me today. My plan for the past several years has been to move into a tiny house when I move out of my parents' house. I want a tiny house so bad and I'm so so excited about it so I thought it'd be fun if in today's video we created a tiny house vision board together on Pinterest. So I'm just going to be looking through Pinterest and finding inspiration and ideas for what I would like my dream tiny house to look like. This is just for fun but I'm just really excited about a tiny house and I want to get a better idea of the type of tiny house I want and how I want to decorate it just because I'm like that and I like to plan things out. Now this plan is very subject to change and so is my style but we're gonna go ahead and do this anyways so I hope you guys enjoy the video and let's go ahead and get started okay so let's go ahead and go to Pinterest so the first thing I'm gonna do is make a new board for all my tiny house inspiration so we're just gonna name it tiny house Okay, so I think what I'm going to search first is just kind of keywords to my style, um, which is like boho, minimal, earthy, plants, yeah, we're just going to see what we can find. I'm going to search boho tiny house. Let's see what we find. Oh my gosh. <laughs> see, this is the problem. I'm going to want to save every single tiny house on the face of this earth to this board. So let's see. That's so cute. That's a that's an RV renovation though. See, this is definitely what I want in my tiny house is like um, a loft bed with like the kitchen underneath. I really like this one. I'm gonna save that. Saved tiny house. These are not really my vibe. I don't know. I'm not really liking these. So let's search something else. That is so cool to have a tree trunk as a mug holder. I'm not sure if I would want that in my tiny house, but I think I'm gonna save it to the board because I don't know, that's just really, really cool. And I could totally make that more my vibe. And I really like that idea. That is so cool. I love the light fixture in this tiny house and the layout and the loft bed and how there's like these baskets and storage. That is really, really cute. And I also love the stairs on this one. That is super cool how like the stairs go over the table, like floating stairs. That is super cool. Oh my gosh, look at this dreamy little, it's like a little bar. And I love how they can look out at the scenery around them while they're sitting there eating. Still not finding anything like completely what I'm looking for. I, I don't know what else to search, but we're going to search plant, plant, tiny, house. This one, I love this one. Um, they have like a little macrame fruit holder hanger. I absolutely love that. They have a cute little fridge and a stove and a sink. Yeah, I really like this one. Another problem is I'm not sure if a lot of these are like true tiny houses, like the type I'm talking about, like one on wheels that you can park somewhere and live in. I don't just mean like a really small house that's like, you know, built on the ground. Like a tiny home on wheels. Yeah, a tiny home on wheels. Let's search that. Okay, here we go. Now I'm starting to see like the more tiny house stuff. Okay. See, I really, really want one of these in my loft bed, like one of those, one of those skylight windows. Oh my gosh, that would be so beautiful. Ooh, that is super cool. It's like on the loft, they have like a bed, but also like a little area over there. I really like that as well. There are just so many possibilities for a tiny house and how you could build one and design it. So yeah, it's going to be hard if, um, I do build a tiny house or buy a tiny house or whatever. It's going to be hard, but I'm really excited. 
oh i love the vibes in this this is super cute so this is a converted truck which is also really awesome and i don't know if i want like a van tiny house or like a trailer tiny house i'm not really sure yet but this is really cool. I'm gonna save that. I love this one. It's super cute. It has a little cute couch and then it has like a storage loft. Um, I think on the other side there's a loft for the bed and that's a really good idea to utilize the space above like your living area um, but also still have a loft bed on the other side. I really like that and I love how they hid the clutter with that little cute curtain. Love all the plants. It's a really nice layout so I'll save this one. I also love this. I'm not really sure what it is, but I really like it, so I'm gonna save it. See, something like this in a tiny house would be so cool. This is kind of what I'm going for, for like my loft bed. So my loft bed would either be over top of like the living area or like the bathroom. So, but I really like this because it's like a loft and then underneath, I love the coziness and then there's like bookshelves and stuff. I love, love, love this one. Oh my goodness, look at this one. Okay, so she has her little clothing rack to do laundry, her loft bed, hanging plants. I really love Tiny Miss Dolly on Wheels as well. I've seen her stuff before. Oh my gosh, look how cool this is. The stairs are like a little decorative shelving unit thing. And the plants right there, that is super, super, super cool. Oh my gosh, I would also love a chair like this in my tiny house. I think that's so cute. This is super, super cute as well. Oh, and this is really cute. It's a bathroom and also like the laundry room in one. There are so many cute ideas, but I hope you guys enjoy just like looking with me and creating like a little vision board. This was super fun. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you so much and I'll see you on my next video.